Hi, this is Aaron Lostness, and today I'm going to cover the preterite tense in Spanish, IR verbs. In this lesson, we're going to briefly cover the rules for the preterite tense, then we're going to conjugate 10 IR verbs, and then we're going to use those in a sentence. So the rules first. The preterite tense is a fixed point of time. So we saw the movie last night would be, Vimos la película anoche. It's also a specific number of actions. She read the book twice. Ella leo el libro dos veces. In an enclosed amount of time, I worked for eight hours. Yo trabajé por ocho horas. So this is how you conjugate normal IR verbs in the past tense. We're going to work with vivir to live and abrir to open. So you replace the IR and you add the appropriate ending. So I lived would be yo viví. You opened would be tu abriste. He lived would be el vivió. We opened would be nosotros abrimos. And they lived would be ellos vivieron. Now, as you can see, there's a couple ways you can say you. If you're familiar with a person, you use tú. If you're not familiar with a person and it's a formal situation, you use usted. So right now, I'm going to go introduce 10 IR verbs to you. I'm going to conjugate them in the I, you, and they form. With the you form, I'm going to go in between tú and usted so you can get practice using both. And I'm going to say it, and then you repeat it, and we'll move on. So, venir, to come. Yo vine, tu viniste, ellos vinieron. Now, as you can see, it has the asterisk by meaning it's a regular verb. It's not going to follow the conjugation that you just went through. These you just have to memorize. Pedir, to ask. Yo pedí, usted pidió, ellas pidieron. Salir, to leave. Yo salí, tú saliste, ellos salieron. Escribir, to write. Yo escribí, tú escribiste, ellas escribieron. Decir, to say or to tell. Yo dije, usted dijo, ellos dijeron. Dormir, to sleep. Yo dormí, tú dormiste, ellas durmieron. Oír, to hear. Yo oí, usted oyó, ellos oyeron. Sentir, to feel. Yo sentí, tú sentiste, ellas sintieron. Mentir, to lie. Yo mentí. Usted mintió. Ellos mintieron. And ear, to go. Yo fui. Tú fuiste. Ellas fueron. Now, as you can see, ear doesn't follow it at all. And you notice most of these are irregular. I need to show you the irregular ones because these are common verbs. You're going to see them a lot, so you just have to memorize their form. Now, let's use these in a sentence. 
I felt sick yesterday, sentir. Me sentí enfermo ayer. She went to the store to buy milk. Ella fue a la tienda para comprar leche. You slept for eight hours last night. Tú dormiste por ocho horas anoche. O usted durmió por ocho horas anoche. Either one is acceptable. It just depends if you're familiar with the person you're talking to. Who told you about the new restaurant? ¿Quién te dijo sobre el nuevo restaurante? She left work early. Ella salió el trabajo temprano. We came to your house last week. Vinimos a su casa la semana pasada. Did you write that? Tú escribiste esto? O escribió usted esto? I asked for a reply. Yo pedí una respuesta. They heard a noise in the room. Ellos oyeron un ruido en el cuarto. She lied to her friend. Ella mintió a su amiga. All right, we've reached the end of another lesson. If you have any questions, you can email me at alostness at hotmail. Or if you'd like, you can go to the website at www.lostnessgroup.com backslash Spanish underscore lessons. There's about 50 lessons covering verbs, pronouns, vocabulary, and there's workbooks to go along with them. Thanks.